All right, so in the last video, I created this monstrosity of a cluster bomb. Well, first of all, if you don't recognize this, you should definitely go watch that last video because it was uh, it was pretty interesting, and there are a lot of big, cool explosions. But anyway, um, I haven't had a ton of time to think of some more in-depth and longer video ideas, but I still wanted to get something out because it's been over a week now. Uh, but anyway, I thought, wouldn't it be interesting to make some modifications to this thing? And which I know, yeah, it's the third video in a row with a uh, cluster bomb, but you know, we'll just call it the trilogy and th this will be it. Uh, it is slowly rotating, I must have bumped into it. But anyway, I wanted to modify this to turn it into a version 2 of the interplanetary missile that I built way back, I, I don't know how long it's been, um, but basically just put some thrusters on this, launch it and stuff, and see how the bombs in behave in space, because I feel like it, is it speeding up? It's absolutely speeding up, I, you know, I'm not gonna question that. Anyway, <laughs> but I wanted to see how the bomb bays actually behave in space, because how they spread out and, um, hopefully create more, or have more time to actually drop the bombs and We'll see what happens, like if I aim it at a planet, um, what happens? Also, I don't really know how it works if like the bombs are released in zero-g, they enter atmosphere. In theory, they'll just start being acted upon by gravity, but it's trial makers, so who knows. Anyway, this thing, can I stop this? Is it, it I don't know why it's doing this. I, I don't even think I did bump it. Now, before I do start modifying this, I should mention, because I don't think I've even mentioned this in a video before, I have a Discord server, and I figured maybe I should advertise it just a little. <laughs> uh, but yeah, in the description, if you didn't know, there's a link to my Discord server, which you can go there and hang out with other people who appreciate the absurdity that I do here. And also, I, you know, I'm in there, and sometimes I'll do announcements and stuff there that I don't do as community posts or whatever on the actual channel, so you know, you should just join that. Anyway, let's actually get into doing this. Now first, uh, I'm just gonna take these off, because there's no air in space, so we don't, we don't need that. Uh, and then next, uh, I want to make it so we can actually have some thrust back here. Uh, and this is, I forgot, this is, <sighs> this is centered on one block, so I, I have to make this all weird how, how am i gonna do this okay i think that's as symmetrical as i'm gonna get uh and i don't well we probably don't need this much thrust oh this is so annoying it's like it's at an angle because of, uh <laughs> why well, you know, i'm never making things odd with again this is just it, this is just so annoying all right well this should be something i have all the controls so i should be able to just oh you know what let me put some quantum rudders on this um because otherwise i feel like we're gonna be going all over the place and that's that's just not very productive and we'll make them red to match the uh the rest of this oh wow oh that's so annoying well actually could i just i could just rotate it and then it doesn't i oh, know that's still annoying everything's just off center but we're not off center, but it's all tilted. Whatever. Anyway, um, this should work. Oh, the hold on, the yaw is reversed. Uh, let's just here. Let's aim it down here. And act well, actually, let's just test to make sure this all works uh, in space first. Let's get some speed and then shift, and then ow. Why is it doing that? It seems to be going in stages, but not not staying on. I, I really don't want to troubleshoot all this. I thought it would just work. All right, let me do a test when it's just still, or almost still. So it spins up. Why is, why is it only releasing one? It's just like doing one at a time and then it resets. I'm hoping this isn't some like Trailmaker's weirdness that I have no control over, but I have a feeling that there's a non-zero chance that that's the case here. I just froze my game while trying to deselect the- <laughs> oh, oh, never mind, we're good. Okay, that- that really just froze, okay. <laughs> Alright, I may have fixed it, maybe? No, no I did not. Alright, let me get the- the one that was working before. If I detach this, 
Huh. Okay, so that... Why, why does that work? Alright, you know, I have an idea. Uh, I'm just gonna grab this. Just like that. And that. And that. I'm going to turn up complexity mod because I'm gonna need it. And then bring in this version. And just grab this. And pop it on the back. And maybe it'll work now. Um, detach. Uh... Okay, what? That doesn't, that doesn't make any sense. What? It is the exact same thing. That has no right to do that. Alright, what I'm gonna do is just start removing stuff from the one we know works uh, until it stops working anymore. Uh, so basically just process of elimination. Okay, now I just have just pretty much the bomb itself. Does it still work? Yes, yes it does. Alright, now what if instead I just modify it this way? It won't look quite as nice, but I think we, uh, I think we're well past the point of making things look nice. Okay, uh, let's see if this thing works. So, it's, okay, it's not quite even, but that's okay. We do have full control over it. That's all, that's really all you can ask for. Um, okay, go. Ooh, I almost hit it. Ah, uh, oh, there we go. Look at that. Oh, that looks really cool. Oh. Somehow they still blow up a little bit. It's doing something. Okay. This this seems like it uh it works. So let's save this. And uh you know what? I'll leave the tail fins on because I really have no idea if taking those off will just break it. Um, I'm thinking it's something with switching the seats, like there was some input that was set back to default or something. Uh, I'm gonna go with that. Um, but anyway, let's actually test this thing and uh, see if it does its thing. Uh, so if I just aim towards the planet, this is a lot harder to control than it. I, I like, than I feel like it should be. Please, please just aim the. Okay, I. <laughs> I, I have no idea why it is this hard to control. This is what yeah, okay, can here let me go into first person. Um sure. Maybe like that. Okay. Yeah, 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 that seems good. Let me get ahead of it. Nope. 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 Ooh. Are they hitting themselves? What? They haven't even entered the atmosphere yet. I think some of them are still left, but I think they... They were just hitting each other. Or not each other, like themselves. Eh, still kind of works. Yeah, but that that is not nearly as much as it should be. What? what? How does that even happen? Alright, you know what? Let me aim this way. And see if I can just, like, throw this into the side of a planet. So, something like... This. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I want to keep a close eye on... What? Okay. What if I take away the spinning part of it? I, I don't really see why this would fix it. Maybe this way it's more stable and they won't... I... <laughs> okay, let's, let's... Let's retry that. Okay, yeah, they're... <laughs> okay, those are definitely gonna blow themselves up, yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, a few of them made it. I feel like this has the potential to be really cool, but it's just, it's not that. All right, what if I get a little closer to the atmosphere before doing this? Because I feel like what's what's happening is the bombs aren't like, they're on the exact same trajectory. Well, no, I, th I think they get pushed. I, they're basically on like the same trajectory as the bomb bays. So when they detach, they just, they just kind of stay with the bays and then hit them maybe I, I don't really know why well, I okay 
Why is this thing so wobbly to control? I, you know, it's fine. I can still kind of use it. And besides, I'm not really trying to aim it that much. Uh, so what if I release it, like, here? It, okay. I guess, I guess I don't, I don't know why that, oh! It doesn't spin up anymore. I thought I changed that. Okay, well now it, it's kind of just acting like the normal cluster bomb again. Still really cool, though. <laughs> that's that's pretty great. All right, let's try this again. It should actually spin up now. If I come in at a nice angle like this, uh, maybe get a little closer. Sure, maybe about there. It's gonna go. Oh, look at that. And then they, whoa, you can see them slow down when they hit the atmosphere. But that kind of gives it an interesting new pattern. Oh, and look at that. Devastation. Almost. Uh. Oh. Oh. Got a little more in. Th okay. <laughs> well, that is just that. That's still so cool. Anyway, also this thing is still controllable, uh, even without the bomb attached to it. What if I fire it into the asteroid field? I feel like that could produce some interesting results. I'm gonna try and get into. Well, maybe not fully orbit, but at least get under the influence of that center rock thing um, and then uh, release them and see what it does. I don't want to hit anything here. If I can get some velocity this way, please don't hit that. Um, okay, maybe I actually do kind of want to be in an orbit. It's kind of hard to do this. Uh, oh, well, that's fine. Didn't need that. Uh, you know what, let's try that. Let's see what it does. That's leaving orbit. That's just, that's just gone. Uh, oh wait, actually, it's kind of coming back. Oh wait, are they actually going to fall down to the surface? Oh. Oh, whoa. Wait. They don't seem to be, like, affected by the gravity of this, them, or if they even are affected by it. It seems like they're they're being, like, flung out, which maybe that does make sense, actually. Wait, but that's actually so cool. What? We just have a, an orbit of these now. I mean, they'll eventually destroy themselves completely. Already, like, half of them are gone, but... Yeah, they're still hitting stuff. Oh, whoa, they've they've split off into, like, two rings here. Okay, well, that that was far more interesting than I thought it would be. Yeah, what if I go over here towards, uh, Nas Nassau? Na I, I, I don't know how to pronounce that. I I never knew how to say that. Um, I, you know, if you do know how to pronounce it, let me know in the comments, because that will give me more engagement on the video. And also, I... I do genuinely want to know how I'm supposed to pronounce that, but whatever. Let's see if the lower gravity here and lower atmosphere does anything. Uh, let's just do it now. That might have been a bit late. It'll still be interesting. Oh, look at that spread. You should get some good distance here. Oh, there we go. And into the canyon, or the crater, rather. Nice. Was that it? I don't think I was high enough up. Yeah, right, I want to go back here. That was by far the most interesting thing I uh, could have expected with this. Um, I want to try it at a bit of a slower speed, though. Okay. Now are we really... Oh. Okay. A little too slow. Uh, oh, I... And now I'm underneath the... Oh. Uh oh. I am inside the asteroid. I was just trying to repair. Can I get out? Please, oh. oh, oh, 
Okay, <laughs> that works. Okay, let's try this again. Uh, I'm just gonna go kind of slide across. Some of them are still flying around. Uh, if I just get a nice... Uh, oh yeah, there we go. Oh, that might be a bit too low. That's not... That is not gonna... Oh no, yep, they just fell right. Well, some of them are Oh. Ah, well, no. Don't let me. <laughs> no, I can't even see them. They hit me. Oh, they're hitting some of the asteroids there. Oh. I'm gonna hit the. Ow. Can we get a nice, nice orbit going? Sure. Let's just try that. That looks. That actually looks pretty good. Oh. Oh, I'm gonna hit it. No, we're good. Oh. Oh, there we go. <laughs> this is so chaotic. Wow. I I did not expect it to be this interesting. I thought I was going to be able to, like, have them... Uh, I'm about to get hit by one. Uh, I thought I was going to be able to launch them and then have them spread out, like, over a long distance and have a ton of explosions heading towards the planet, but that didn't really work. But honestly, this is... This is just as good, if not better. Okay, maybe not quite as cool as having a massive amount of explosions, but still, still a pretty interesting result. Uh, that's pretty much all I was gonna do with this. If you're still here at the end of the video, most people aren't, so good, good job. Congratulations. Thanks. I, yeah, <laughs> uh, let me know what else uh, I should do. Um, hopefully, I'll have some more time to come up with some more unique <laughs> unique ideas because this was uh, a bit a bit lazy but it was interesting and hey if it if it uh, if I can edit it into an entertaining video that's a success um, but anyway uh, join join my discord server please it's in the description the link is uh, you should definitely do that um, but yeah anyway that's uh that's about it for this i guess um i guess i'll just fly this into uh into the uh, little moon rock thing here and then as soon as i hit it the video will just end because that's just all i do now come on and get it get it going i don't want to miss here come on just I'm gonna hit an asteroid or something. That would not be good. Okay, here we go, here we go. There we go, okay. Avoid these. There we go. And... Oh. Alright, let's detach it. And as soon as I hit, the video will be over.